Yeah, my name is David Bogan. I'm the marketing manager for the uh, Maxim Puma and now the Optum Line series of tractors here in North America. We got a new tractor where we're introducing here at Farm Progress today, a new, new series of tractors, new family name actually, the Optum series, which is that one being available here at launch with the 270 and 300 uh, model number and CVT configurations. And one of the new things about them too is you, is you look at them, they obviously have a new dramatic look to them. And this is the new styling that's going to come into the Case IH line of tractors. You're going to see this styling permeate through the entire high horsepower family in the coming years. This series of tractors would be great for the way we got it hooked up here at the show with a big large square baler behind it. So for those, those large volume producer hay operations and, and uh, um, also be a great tractor for uh, triple mowers because you can put a front PTO in the front of this tractor, put a triple mower in front and be a great mowing tractor given its horsepower size and its ability to have that front PTO on it as well. Another great application for this tractor would be any haulage or transport applications like slowly hauling given it's almost, it's kind of like a compact high horsepower tractor. But, it was built on the foundations of a Puma, but it's much more than a high horsepower Puma. It weighs 7,000 pounds more than a Puma, so right there it tells you there's a lot more beefed up, a lot more irons been put into this tractor, redesigned from the ground up. The engine underneath is a, it's the same 6.7 liter engine that we have in the Puma fact in the tractors as well as well as the lower horsepower magnets. But what we have added to it to get that additional horsepower is that electronic variable geometry turbocharger. It gives us that additional horsepower, an additional boost, just like the CVT transmission as well. Same CVT transmission in its foundation that we have in the Puma, but that too has been beefed up for these heavier applications. Final drive has been beefed up, double planetary gears, a stronger rear axle as well. And that's where a lot of that additional weight comes from because it's just a much more heavier HD type tractor, so to speak. One thing I want to point out here in the front axle here, we put that class 4.75 axle, that same axle that we put on our, our Magnum tractors. What that will allow us to do is put dual wheels on the front of these tires as well and do it up for row crop applications as well. This tractor is also able to go up to class 49 tires as they call them in the industry, which allows us to put up to 900 millimeter wide tires on the back. That's some pretty big slicks. Looking at the rear end of this tractor, we've really beefed up the hydraulics on this tractor, giving us a standard of 43 and up to 55 gallons of flow coming out of the rear end, with 30, 37 gallons of flow available at one remote. Really open up more opportunities for larger, larger planters and tillages than a traditional Puma wouldn't be able to handle.